Oh, there's her mom. I didn't get to talk to the other one. Damn it. So where is he now? He's looking around the village. Oh, honey, I think he's came in. Fucking damn. What is it? Oh, fuck. He's broken into our house. Excuse me, you got a shitter. I need to take a fat one in your shitter. Oh, Mr. Claw, what is the matter? I would just walk around the village and found my way here. I had a bit of that strawberry jam in the rose hips and it gave me the squirts unlike any you ever believed before. Of course. Every man like that would get the shit that's very manly. But you surprised me. Oh. Was I interrupting something? No, no, no. Of course not. Mom, get the fuck out! Mr. Clug! What I was talking about? Get the fuck out! You're embarrassing me! Oh, this is him. Pleased to meet you, Mr. Claude. I'm Wester, Arena's mother. I love young Dick. I mean, my daughter told me that you saved her when she was in danger. Hmm. Oh, sure. Ain't nothing. Certainly not. If you'd come just a little later, it would have been tragic. I keep telling her it's too dangerous, so don't go to the Shingo Forest, but that girl doesn't listen. Mom, shut the fuck up! You're embarrassing me! Dad! Rena, I'm just thinking about- NOPE! Shit. Oh, it sounds bloody good. Hi, Mom. I won't be long. <laughs> okay, fine. Yeah. Pleased to meet you, Mom. Yeah. Let's go back in and talk to your mom. Sorry about that. Mother gets so excited. Don't worry about it. She's just like my mom. Oh, really? Maybe we have the same mom. Is that all? I've barely shown you around at all. Well, fuck. Who's your friend? I've never seen him around before. This guy's Dick McSlick. Let's see if this kid understands when Rena talks to her. You're like the shingle forest, don't you? Take me along this time. Hell no. I'm not gonna let you into my supply of crack cocaine. Yo, shit. Damn. No, let's get the fuck out. Oh my god. What is the problem? I can only show you around the village. Fuck! I already talked to everybody. They already know that they don't know any shit. I haven't seen Mr. Allen in a while, but he'll be blowing me soon. Ugh. Fuck. Alright, let's go over here, let's talk to the rest of the villagers. Oh, let's go in the church. Maybe this is where we need to go. This is the earliest church where they hold weddings. The priest here is very earnest, and he's a real fucking stud muffin. He sounds like a wonderful dick. Yes, we all depend on him. Let's talk to this priest again. Freaking swarms of earthquakes. God must be trying to tell us something. It is only through prayer that we can know God's will. Why don't you stay? Nope! That's okay, I understand. I'm blind. It's so unusual to see you at church. Wait, what'd she say? I hope it doesn't snow. Uh... <clears throat> Good morning, sir. Hi, Rena. My, you're chipper today. You're a chipper dipper. <laughs> Right, let's go in here and talk to this lovey-dovey couple. They're so lovey-dovey it is embarrassing just watching them. I see. Oh. I see. Let's, let's talk to these newlywed couples again. You're here with your boyfriend today? Please don't misunderstand. He's our guest. Fuck you. Please make her happy. I will try. What? What? So, like, he's like, I will try making her happy just like them. And then she's like, aw. Oh. So, like, I... They're dating now. That's canon. They're dating. Okay, let's go talk to fucking this dude. What up? You too found a boyfriend to walk with. Your mother's bound to be worried. Damn. 
chick must get around. Every goddamn fucking guy she gets around, a fucking boyfriend. The man in this house is a carpenter. He is now working on a big job in a neighboring town, so he's gone most of the time. So the two kids are home alone. Yeah, I feel sorry for them. I come over and tell them stories as much as I can. That's nice, Rena. You're really fucking nice. Damn. Not really. Fuck yeah, you're nice. Shut the fuck up and let's get the fuck out of here. God damn. Alright. Fuck's in here. This is the mayor's house. Where the fuck is the mayor at? He doesn't seem to be here. Fuck that guy then. Let's go back already. I need to get the fuck out of here. Mom's just standing in the middle of the kitchen like a fucking psycho. I just don't finish the preparations. Preparations? What the fuck do you do, Mom? You're gonna kill me? You're gonna stab me and eat my intestines? Holy shit, Mom. You cook so much, I'm gonna ship for a week. It is a bit much. Don't you know how much young men can eat? You must love to eat, Mr. Crowd. Mm. God damn it, Mom. You fucking bitch. One hour later, Claude is shitting on the toilet. Because these guys don't know how the fuck to cook. Cooking is the least developed skill on their planet. One hour later, they have two beds. Are you okay? I'm fine. I've got an iron dick! I'm glad you liked it. You better than fucking like it. I'm gonna kill you, bitch. You better like that shit, motherfucker. Damn. Boy, am I full. I wonder how mom's doing. Really no need to worry. Fuck dad though. I don't even think about his ass. I wonder what's keeping her. I'm just gonna stand in the middle of the bedroom. Everyone in this game likes fucking standing like psychos. We just had to stay upstairs. Well then don't fucking wonder about what she's doing. Damn. I'll just walk into her room though. I shouldn't be going to someone else's room without permission. Well, if you don't want to go downstairs, and you don't want to go in the fucking place, then what the fuck do you want to do? No one knows. Oh, hi, Westa. Damn, this guy's got a good memory. I didn't even notice her name was said. Hope you like the food. Do you think I made too much? Not at all. Oh, it's really good. Thank you for dinner. What a polite young man. You are quite welcome. Oh, my God. Do you like milks? Was it really good? Yes, really. Really, really? Yes, now let's fuck. If the warrior didn't like my food. What well, fuck, mate? Hey, wow, are ya? Oh shit. I'm not supposed to be able to say that you're the warrior, even though if you really were, you'd fucking say outright. That makes no sense at all. She's like, later. I fucked it up. And the arena comes upstairs and punches you in the face. I'm asking you what the matter is. Mm. What the fuck did you say, Mom? The warrior. You said that! And you seem to really understand. 